Hello, everyone. Thank you all for tuning in today to my simple skincare. I am going to be doing a little simple skincare routine featuring some really exciting products by 27 Rosier, and I am so excited to share all of these with you all. With you all. And then after uh, I show you kind of my skincare, I'm gonna take you through a little like get ready with me with some of my favorite makeup products to achieve like a super natural glow. So yeah, hi everyone. Okay, I'm really excited because I have been using these products for the past like two weeks and like obsessed, chef's kiss so good. So let's just get right into it, okay. So, I just finished washing my face with this product. It is the Fight Grime Deep and Fresh Gel Cleanser. This is the packaging for reference. And it's actually like a glass. So, I, I really love that because it feels like, you know, you're getting quality, a quality product in a nice glass. And um, so, I just kind of want to tell you more about what this cleanser does. For like little context, I have sensitive skin, so um, I try to find products that are really natural and gentle because I get like very irritated with like heavy fragrance or just really like with a lot of not natural ingredients, I tend to like break out in hives. So finding the right product is super important to me. So when I saw that they made a cleanser, I was really excited to try it. So this one, um, it has um, starring, it has moringa in it, and it's like full of antioxidants. So that's really great, and it helps cleanse impurities and pollutants from your skin, which is like very essential. And um, it helps you feel like radiant and fresh, and it's super easy to use. Um, so all you have to do is like you take this you put about it comes with like a little pump so it's not a spray um i don't know if you can see but it's like it, it's a gel um so yeah you just put one pump on your hand and then you just kind of like rub that with um some well first wet your hands and then do a pump and then rub it into your skin um and that's how that's all you have to do um i just did one pump it has a very like light fragrance to it and it kind of just smells like fresh, um, like aloe to me, uh, which I personally really like. Um, it's really, really gentle. It makes your skin after. It feels like there's no like leftover oils or any residue on there. It just feels really clean and it doesn't overstrip your skin. It doesn't leave it feeling dry at all. So that's what I did this morning. You can use this in the morning and the night. Yeah, no. And my skin doesn't feel tight after using this at all. Um, like I just washed my face and it feels just really clean. Um, doesn't feel overly dry. So that's really important. Um, so yeah, and then how you know it's working is it'll start to like foam up as you wash. So yeah, I like to start off with this. Highly recommend this, especially if you have sensitive skin. I feel like my skin looks like really nice, clean, glowy after using it. So yeah, highly recommend this. After the cleanser, I will take you through. So the next product is the Here We Glow Again. And I've heard such good things about this in the reviews. Apparently, if you're trying to achieve a super like glow from the inside type of look, like this is the product that you need. Um, so I have used this and what I've noticed is like I don't even need to use highlighter when I use this because it leaves your skin so glowy. So this is um, a protect and revive serum. This is, um, let me tell you the exact ingredients. Um, they use star ring, or no, sorry, it has Tara Spinosa. Um, to protect from external stressors causing dry and dull skin and then it just lets your skin glow and you just apply this in the morning and night for like after you've washed your face so it's just like any normal serum I've kind of swapped out using some of my other serums for using this one because I really like that glowy natural look so I'm just gonna take like a pump of this this is what the product looks like it's kind of if you can see that, it's actually like 
golden. So I'm going to take this. I took about a pump. You just kind of rub it on. It smells exactly like the cleanser, which it just kind of smells natural and like aloe, um, in my opinion. But it feels really lightweight when you put it on. I'm going to put on one more pump just to like get everything. Again, it has like that glowy, kind of has sparkles in it. It almost looks like a highlighter already. But yeah, and then you just kind of put this everywhere on the skin. Blends in really well. If I had my roller, I like to use my Rose Quartz roller to like roll in product. So if you have that or like a gua sha, feel free to use that with this product to like get the contour in your face and kind of just giving yourself a little massage as you apply the product. Oh, let me present that to you all. Okay, yeah. So this product is so nice. If you're looking for like dewy, glowy looking skin, this is your product. And it's also really gentle on the skin if you have sensitive skin, so don't worry about that. And it just smells really good. But yeah, this is what it looks like on already. And I feel like it leaves your skin a little bit bouncy. I don't know if that makes sense. Um, but yeah, this stuff, so great. As a reminder, you do get 15% off um, from watching the live stream. So you get 15% off during the live stream and then 30 minutes after the live stream if you want to purchase any of these skincare products and get a little discount. And if you go into my profile or if you click the little box with the four squares, you can look at this little collection and look at the products direct. So yeah. I highly recommend taking advantage of having a deal on these because skincare is not cheap and uh, these products are really nice. So it's nice being able to get a discount as you try them. So yeah, this stuff so great and I feel like my skin is so glowy. And then after that, I'm gonna go in. I'm gonna go in with their moisturizer and I'm so excited because my favorite part of skincare is facial moisturizers. I find that that's so important and that's how you prevent like all the wrinkles on your face and just keeping your skin looking glowy and youthful. Moisturizers, so important. So this is their Quench My Thirst moisturizer. I like how the packaging is really small. And it's not like a jar or like a little tub. I find that this is really great for travel too because it's just really small in comparison to my face. Um, it's just, it's really nice. So this is like an everyday lightweight moisturizer. So if you kind of, this is honestly geared for anyone, like all, all skin types. So if you have like dry skin, this will work for you. Even if you, if you have oily combination, anything. This is just a very good like neutral facial moisturizer. And uh, let me tell you the specifics. So um, it has Oro, Oro Banchi Rapham to help exhausted and thirsty skin feel replenished and glowy. And you also can apply this morning, night. Thank you. I didn't see that comment. Thank you. Um, yeah, so play this, apply this morning and night, and you'll feel really good. So I'm going to put that on now so you guys can see the texture. And they also noted that you can use this as a sleeping mask as well. So you can just apply a layer at night, leave it on overnight, and your skin will feel extra hydrated and replenished. So let me show you. comes out really easily, so if you do get this, don't squeeze too hard or you'll get too much product. Just a little side note. So I just squeezed it a little bit. This is what it looks like. And kind of like showing you the texture as you blend it out. It's not a very heavy cream as you can see. It's more kind of like a gel. It kind of melts into your skin as soon as you apply it. So as you can see, like there's no white layer to it. It's just really lightweight. So I'm gonna apply that everywhere. You really don't need a lot of product, again, which is really nice um, because it'll last a long time. And this also has the same smell as the cleanser and the serum. It's just like a very like lightly fragranced aloe kind of smell, which I personally like because it smells like a spa and like a facial treatment. 
or it is a facial treatment, but it feels like you're getting like a professional facial treatment. So I really like this moisturizer because of how it doesn't leave your skin feeling oily after. It just feels really hydrated and it just melts into your skin and it becomes like second skin pretty much. So yeah, that's what I like to do. If you have any questions on any of these products, more than happy to answer them. So yeah, kind of recapping, I like to go in with the cleanser. And this is the Fight the Grime one. This one's really, really nice. Don't be deceived by the bottle. It's not a spray. It has a pump on it. Now my hands are slippery and I can't open this. Okay, yeah. Has a pump on it. You just need one pump of product. You mix it in with your wet hands and use it and you're good to go. And it blends really easily. I kind of want to show you guys the texture of this. So I'll put a little bit on for you. Okay. Just so you can see the texture, it's a clear cleanser and you have what, make sure you have wet hands when you use this and then it just like kind of builds up. So right now, as you can see, since they're, it's not wet, it's not foaming, but when your hands are wet, it suds up, it foams and it cleans off all of the gunk off of your face. And if you're wearing makeup, this also helps just get rid of any extra like leftover makeup that may got may have been left behind after using your makeup remover so yeah this stuff is great this is my new favorite cleanser i'm gonna be using this for a while like for a while because this is so good um i just really love that it doesn't leave my skin feeling super dry and that's super important to me i hate the feeling of having like tight skin where like a cleanser completely wipes away everything from your face which is like some people may like that but i i absolutely hate that i feel like my skin is like so tight but anyways moving on if any of you don't have questions about any of these products i'll kind of just do a little get ready with me so i'm gonna go in after using the three products so since i use this i feel like i don't need highlighter because it's like super glowy i don't know what do we think? I think it's pretty glowy. I don't think I need highlighter. But something I want to remind you all as you get ready is to make sure you apply your sunscreen. I always apply sunscreen um, as I do my makeup because you've got to take care of your skin. It's so important. Yeah, sunscreen is so, so, so important. So I like to use, um, if you're wondering, I use like a Korean skincare sunscreen. Um, this stuff is really good. I personally like like sun essences. So this is more like a, a like, like serum type sunscreen. So yeah, I like to use that. Um, after I've washed my face, put on the sunscreen. This one has a nice, uh, like kind of apricot smell. It feels so good because the moisturizer kind of was a good prep on my skin and I feel like all the products are just melting together and absorbing really well mm. yeah that is so nice okay I've just applied my sunscreen sunscreen is so important yeah so recap use this which is the 27 rosier quench my thirst moisturizing cream super lightweight this also makes a really great primer in my my opinion like a good base because it's not too heavy it's very light so you just add a light layer to your skin so after i've applied that i went in with the sunscreen sunscreen so important and then i feel like i really like this glow on my skin so i'm not gonna put on any powder because i like the glowy look then i'm gonna go in with a little bit of concealer I'm just using the, the Glossier Stretch Concealer and because it's very creamy and it just kind of melts. And since we use that moisturizing cream, it's like a good base. So everything just blends really easily with that. Yeah, there we go. How's everyone's day going? I hope you all are having a great day. I have been having a good day been a little bit busy in the process of moving 
We all know how moving goes. And it's super hot. What's it like where you are? I'm so curious to know because I have been sweating buckets. Okay. So that's where I like to put on my concealer. I, I like the very like natural, no makeup kind of look. I don't know about you all. Yeah, I feel that. The heat is a killer. But I have met people who do love warm, hot weather. Like, desert style. Okay. So that's really... That blends really easily. My skin feels hydrated. Glowy. Wow. That looks so good. So I don't even need a foundation or anything. I think this concealer is good enough. Yeah. And you can really see the Protect and Revive Serum underneath the skin just glowing. I think that looks really good. It looks like I already have highlighter on. Okay. After that, I like to kind of make it more natural by putting on like a simple blush. I'm using a cream blush so that it like melts more into your skin to look more natural, to look more like you're radiating from within. So this one's by Merit. This is the terracotta color. I'm going to go ahead and apply that to the upper part of my cheekbones. So you guys can kind of see. I've been told that the trick is you apply this to your cheekbones and you keep it on like the higher points to make your skin and your face look more like it's lifted instead of drooping down. I find that this like actually works. I think it looks good. So I'm going to blend that in here. I like to use my fingers when I do my makeup because I feel like it blends in more naturally and it just looks more like like you were born with it, you know? Okay. There's that. Wow. Yeah, this moisturizer, holy grail, so good. It makes applying makeup so easy. I'm going to apply a little bit more. And then I also like to do the kind of like sun-kissed kind of look. So after that, I'm going to apply it to like right here at the bridge of your nose. It gives you, like, that little, like, you just got a little bit too much sun look. I've seen so many people do it, and I think it looks really cute, actually. Um, so I'm going to pull a little bit more. I like the little rosy look. And then I'm going to put a little bit on, like, the end. Yeah. I think that looks good. What do we think? Looks super natural. Mm-hmm. Okay. That's that for blush. I think that looks pretty good. I think that looks very natural. Looks like I'm like wearing no makeup, you know, but it looks, it just looks good. And then, oh my gosh, I forgot to do, I forgot to do eye cream, but it's too late for that. But if you're wondering, I like to use an eye cream with a little, like, this little divot. Because I feel like that's really, really nice. It's like you're giving your eyes a little massage and people forget to moisturize their eyes. So this is your reminder to moisturize your eyes and your eyelids is what I mean. But yeah, so I like to do that. And then after that, I'm going to take this. This is really cool. This is like a little eyelash curler. I got this off of, uh, I got this somewhere online. I don't remember, but it's a little, this is really good if you have Asian lashes because mine are just like straight and they, well, they don't really curl if you don't use an eyelash curler. So I'm gonna just curl them really fast. Yep, that's all you need. Wow. And then from there, I'm gonna do the other eye. I like to go like six times. Okay, that looks good, looks natural. I don't want them too dramatic right now. Then I'm just gonna go in with the Fenty Beauty mascara as a little light coat. Mm hmm. There we go. 
I don't like to put too too many coats on because I don't want it to look chunky and I feel like that kind of goes against the no makeup makeup look. Okay. Now let's do the other eye. But this is usually all I do for my makeup just cuz I really like looking natural. I'm trying to like show your natural beauty. Mm -hmm. And little fun fact, the brand 27 Rosier, their whole mission too is um, showing your inner beauty and like glowing from within. So kind of goes with the theme. And then from there to kind of finish things off, um, yeah, I don't know if you can tell, but I, I didn't put on too much mascara because I wanted it to look really natural. Um, I have a little bit. Okay. I'm going to actually go in. I have another mascara. This one is by, like, it's a Korean brand. It's called Uni Club. They make, like, a smaller one, and I feel like this grabs more of my lashes. So just going to top it with that before we complete the look. Okay, I think that looks, I don't know if that made a difference, actually. But I think that looks good. And then, now that we have our blush, we have our mascara, we put on a little bit of concealer, and I don't need any highlight because the moisturizer, or not the moisturizer, the serum gave me all the highlight and glow that I need. I'm going to finish off with um, a little bit of brows and then some balm on the lip. So this one is just like the Glossier Boy Brow. This is just a light little eyebrow gel to keep your brows in place, kind of fill in any of those empty spaces. Oh, I kind of put a lot there. Yep. I think that looks pretty natural. What do we think? Do we think this looks natural? Does it look like it's the no makeup makeup look? Okay. Okay, there we go. Thank you. Yeah, I agree. Super glowy. I think it looks really good. And then from there, to finish off this little simple skincare routine, natural glow, I'm going to use this Everyday Humans. It's a balm diggity wonder salve. And this is just like a, just a generic balm. You have a different balm that works just as well. Has this little applicator. And it's just a clear balm because I like the, like, glossy look. I don't know about you all, but glossy is cute. And it hydrates. Okay. Good. Okay, that's, that's that. That is the completed get ready makeup look. No makeup makeup look. How... How does it look? Let me know. Yes. Thank you. But yeah, just to kind of recap everything that we did today in this little get ready with me slash skincare routine. I first went in with the Fight Grime Gel Cleanser. Can't recommend that enough. It just gets everything ready, prepared to like do your makeup. Um, super nice. Reminder, this is really great for sensitive skin. And then after you wash your face, to achieve the natural inner glow look, you have to use the Here We Glow Again Protect and Revive Serum. This stuff is so freaking good. You want to save money on getting highlighter, I highly recommend getting this stuff because it just looks like you... Don't, it looks like you're wearing highlighter, but you don't need any because it's just so good. Usually, when I apply highlighter, I like to apply highlighter right here. And it looks like I already have some on. What? Ah, so good. 
yeah okay but so it looks like i have it on and i usually also put it on um highlight on right here and it looks like i have some on there so that is so freaking good save money on highlight purchase this product to help you get a glowy look but at the same time it also has all the benefits of like just a normal facial serum that helps with just reviving the skin and just adding a bunch of benefits to your skin and it beats like having to like put on additional serums and then put on highlighter and the highlighter doesn't really have ingredients that are like great for your skin but this stuff has ingredients that are great for your skin and um it's it's a really like i would say this is a decent size like you literally only need about two pumps maximum of this product to get it all over your face and then you'll look really glowy like this so highly recommend this if i were to pick like a favorite out of everything this is my favorite because you're doubling in with like a two-in-one a serum and a natural highlighter I personally really like the glowy highlight look. I know it's not for everyone, but I think it really accentuates your natural features. It makes you look like a glowy angel. And then the last product I use um, is the Quench My Thirst Easy Going Moisture Cream. We've been talking about this a lot, but it's actually because it's so good and it really made applying makeup super easy and it feels like my skin is hydrated, my skin doesn't feel oily, and even like putting this on with the sunscreen, you would think that your face would feel super oily and like heavy, but my skin feels really light when I touch it. It doesn't feel like there's a lot of product, like there's like nothing on my hands when I wipe it. So my skin really absorbed it, which is good. And it comes in this really convenient size to use for like traveling. I was a little bit nervous that this was like gonna be super small, but it's the perfect size. And you can apply this morning, night, and it doubles as a face cream. So a lot of these products are really versatile and can be used in multiple ways, which is another reason to get things because it's just a better bang for your buck, in my opinion. Um, I personally really value products that can have like, that are multifunctional because it's just more worth it in my opinion. So yeah, highly recommend this. As a reminder, I have extremely sensitive skin. So if you have sensitive skin, these products will work great for you and they are all natural and they're not heavily fragranced. I personally hate products that have like a major like scent to it because I get headaches and this does not give me headaches because it's so like light. So that's really nice. My skin type is sensitive slash um, I would say my skin is like kind of oily combination I do kind of get a little bit oily skin um but I didn't notice I noticed that these products only kind of helped um with my skin type or like kind of brought out the best parts of like my skin type if that makes sense but anyways that is everything that I wanted to talk about show you all um if you have any other questions before I head out um feel free to comment them and yeah i'll give it like a few seconds if there's any questions um don't forget that you get 15 percent off if you want to try out any of these products i really really love these products and i am gonna buy this again as soon as they run out because they're genuinely really good and as a reminder if i could recommend something that's the best it's this like honestly tell your friends tell your like whoever that loves like looking glowy get this product it's so good okay i'm done talking but thank you so much for tuning in i hope you all have a great rest of your day and if you try to achieve this look tag me on my instagram at anisa marie it's the same as this handle and i'll see you guys next week Bye.